Now continue to create views. Add broken section view on this front view. Pick view. Define the boundary and depth point. Unpick dynamic hatch. Get this broken view with key group information. Create another one on the other side. Same operations. Pick views. Define the boundary and depth point. This side includes key group and whole features. Next, create section view. Pick base view and direction points. Set location method as none and define the location point. Finish. This is the section view, but I want a cross section view. How to do it? Redefine it. Set section method as sec curves. Now, this is the cross section view. Create another one. Pick base view, direction points, and location point. Done. Let's modify label attribute. Label tab. Don't show label prefix. Change height value. This is the result. We do it again. To keep a uniform position, the label bin needs to be moved. Set filter as text firstly, and then move the label. All views for this shaft case have been created.